Okay, this is Tony with Tony's Realties, affiliated with Keller Williams Preferred Realty. And I wanted to take you onto a driving tour of the Macintosh on the lake. Now, this subdivision is comprised of 10 little subdivisions, and I believe it's going to be more, because it looks like there's more land in there that they can build. Um, and the fun factor about the subdivision, you have something for everyone in that sub. In that sub. So you have the townhomes for the newlyweds or the first time home buyers, or even the ones that um, just want to be in the great neighborhood. Then you have two stories or one and a half stories on some of the other properties. And then you have about three different subdivisions that are ranch homes. And one is considered a 55 plus subdivision. So we are going to take a tour and go see all of those homes. And I'm glad you're coming along with me and hope you enjoy the ride and get to know the information on Macintosh on the lake. So I am in the Macintosh and we have the Glen, which is the current 55 plus community. Um, and there's 10. So you got three subdivisions that have nothing but one story homes. Um, and they have townhouses and two story and one story. Let's drive into one of the subdivisions and let's take a peek at them so you can get an idea. This is the Glen, which is the 55 and plus subdivision. So as you can see, these are all ranch homes. Very nice homes, in fact. And you got a little pickleball court here for the seniors. Not sure if they're using it, but there it, it is here. All right, and then let's go a little further down. And like I said, there is roughly about 10 little subs in the main sub. And there's a lake around here somewhere. So. We are going to venture around, look at a couple of subdivisions, and then highlight some of the main activities um, that the community have. So currently there isn't any um, homes in this shoot. There isn't any any there isn't any um, ranch homes available in this one subdivision, but there is another subdivision um, called the um, Burkdale that has, that they are building now, that has a tremendous a lot of homes that are one story in for sale, which is really nice. Looks like somebody just bought a house. Are we doing the floors? So, in the Macintosh on the Glen, you have the Avalon, the Ballantry, the Burkdale, the Braemare, the Glenmore, Inverness, Ken Rose Towns, Presswick, Tayside, and the Glen. But there's also look like there's a plan for some more houses to be built. It's a big area. So I'm thinking they have enough room and they're gonna build some more homes. But this community here, the Glen, is the 55 and plus. And this is the main road that goes, that we're getting ready to turn on, that goes throughout the whole subdivision. The one thing that is really good, and then we have some parks, some playgrounds, or is this the clubhouse? Yes, this is the clubhouse. You have basketball courts, and look how huge that clubhouse is. You got swim pools, you got a little bit of everything, dog parks. 
is really big. So the other thing that's really nice about the subdivision, you got um, walking trails, but they're having a national night out. I'm sure they got a swimming team as well. So the one thing that's really nice about this subdivision is the HOA covers the lawn care. How nice is that? You don't see too many um, subdivisions that will carry the whole entire community sub um, lawn care, which is really good. They have the clubhouse, pickleball, you name it, they have it out here. So, just wanted to give you a little tour. We're going to make a turn coming up here soon and go back. So, they currently have nine new construction homes on that are being built in one of the areas. We're going to make a little Yuli here and go back. They got nine new construction. They have two resale homes. In the last 30 days, six homes closed. So the homes are being brought real quick. And they have 13 pending. And those 13 pending, um, 11 are new construction. So you know, they may take a little longer to complete um, than the 15 to 30 days. The homes inside are really nice. Most of them are hardwood floors, um, granite, countertops, and everything. So let's see if we can see a couple more homes. And then that will be the tour of Macintosh on the lake. And you can give me a call anytime and I can come out here and help you look. So see right here, you can't see it right now, but there it looks like they're digging for some more land, for some more homes right there. And Macintosh on the lake is in Burlington, North Carolina. The home, not the home, but Elon University is close by. You have the Glenmore which is a one-story subdivision. And the price range for these homes go anywhere from 350 up to about 600. So let's sneak into this one. We'll go here. This is called the Glenmore. These mainly are all brick homes, patio homes. Very nicely built. There's one on the contract right there. One story or one and a half story homes. So, these are good. As you can see, this whole section is all brick homes. And then when we go back on the main road, we'll look at the new construction site of homes that are being built. And the new subdivision is called Brookdale. And the Burkdale is the one that has nine homes for sale right now. They're on their final phase, so they're almost finished. And so the price range goes from 400 to 540. And if you're interested, you really should give me a call and come by and look. So, yeah, 
ranch homes here, one and a half stories, master downstairs, really nice. So these are Macintosh on the Lake homes in Burlington, North Carolina. You can give me a call and I'll be glad to show you some new homes. They have a ton. This is the last phase that they're building, but they have a ton of homes that are still available for sale. Nicely done on the interior. And maybe the next time I do a drive tour, I'll go in one of them and we can do um, a home visit on one of the homes. Look at these. These are really nice homes. Not all of these are vacant, but you can tell the ones that have already been purchased what you got for sale. Great homes. One story, you're looking for a ranch with a sunroom in the back. This will be the perfect place for you to come. New homes are in the making. So, once again, this is the Burkdale of Macintosh on the lake. Sorry, I didn't get to take you to see the lake, but maybe the next time will do that. And there's also two entrances into the subdivision. We came in one entrance and we're going to go out another entrance. Now, the good thing about um, Macintosh on the lake, it is right behind a very good Alamance Crossing Center where you have food places, shopping, um, grocery stores, and everything. So you have the Newburgh and the Braemore subdivision. Yes, yeah, so we are going to head on out of Macintosh in a few seconds. Um, we'll look at townhouse community. It's on the right, left. And then they're building a new townhouse community as well. So you got two new townhouse community. And this is the Aberdeen, which is also part of Macintosh on the lake. So as we head out, I hope you enjoyed the ride today. And we will be back to do another tour of another great subdivision but the Presswick as we pass by I want to thank you and have a great day